Hi, and welcome to my tutorials on Euclid's Elements, Book 1. This video demonstration is going to be on Proposition 23 of Book 1, which gives us the construction methods needed to take a given angle and to copy it onto a given line so that we can draw another angle that is equal to the first one. So let's start with our given angle, alpha, and our line segment AB. And our goal is to copy alpha onto the point A. First thing we do is we define two points on our lines D and E. Doesn't matter where they are as long as they're on the lines. Construct a triangle CDE. Now if we use the methods from Proposition 22, which, if we have three line segments, we can construct a triangle. Here we have three line segments E, C, and D. So we will construct a triangle onto the line segment AB. First thing we're going to do is to copy the line or the length D onto AB. Next, we will copy the line CD onto the point A. Copy the length DE onto the point F. Label the intersection of the two tri of the two circles as G, and construct a triangle AGF. These two triangles are equal because we have the side is equal to the side, the side is equal to the side, and so forth. And thus we have the angle at C is also equal to the angle at A. And the proof of this is very simple. If you remember from Proposition 8, if we have two triangles where the three sides are all equal, where E is E, C, C, D, D, in other words, side, 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 the triangles are equal in all respects, including the angles inside the triangles. So these two angles are equal. And thus we have demonstrated how to copy a given angle onto a given line segment. And that concludes this video presentation. To see the next presentation, just click the Next button.